the end of my tether, so I can't fully make it there, but. <laughs> yeah, that's one for our science team. Yeah, not sure about that one. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's like a combo between a Tina Flora skate and a CP cumber. Yeah. I. I've never seen that. We've got a little more tether. Get There's the a challenge for you. What is that? Okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's remarkable. That's uh, stumping uh, all of us here in the back row so far. But we're checking out the ID log to see if we can uh, figure out what we're looking at here. You give it a little more. Does it have ten? Of, does it have like? Sort of looks like some type of octopod with its yeah. Oh, skirt up. Animal. There's a couple <laughs> guesses here in the chat room as well. Oh, oh it's just, uh, doubled up. Squid. Yeah. Upside down. Upside down curled up squid. Yeah, so it does, does look like this squid. So I think... Uh, C and I. Yeah. Yep, there we go. So Scott was right. A really wonderful imagery, yeah, so that is a squid. Yeah, I wonder if that's uh, almost seemed to be in disguise there on the seafloor. I wonder if that's uh, common behavior. Uh, folks on the line get on the other before side maybe of Mike it? or other other squid uh, experts keep rotating, rotating to the uh, right. Common. Yeah, you keep going right. Yeah, it looks sure. like uh, Mike. It's it's uh, mollusk Tuesday here on the ship. Uh, I'm seeing a lot of them. You know, really spectacular imagery here. Hey, Mike. <laughs> that you? Hey, it's Mike again. Um, and I wish I could tell you exactly what that is, but I'm going to have to work on that a bit. Uh, there's a couple of uh, different families that have sh these short-bodied uh, squids with very long fins. Um, the cyclotuphidae is is, uh, is a, my Seriously, current guess the right now. Another minute. Uh, when we catch them in trawls, they get so beat up that they're they're really hard to identify. And so this is a beautiful specimen, and not what I'm used to looking at because it's not beat up. That's beautiful behavior that you're documenting there. Yeah, I'm trying to keep them at the same distance, but yeah. And you bring up a really good point there, Mike, about the value of these high quality imagery. So yeah, a lot of uh, taxonomists, they're used to working with specimens that have been collected in trawls and have been completely uh, butchered, and uh, and so you, you lose a lot of the qualities, but That's you also beak. don't get the bottom. behavior. Uh, so that. this yeah. is yeah, really remarkable. It? Would it be possible to get the, the other side of this? Um, okay. I mean, it's, it's slowly turning. Can we wait till it finishes turning around, or can the sub move around so we can see underneath um, of the body. We'll just yeah, hopefully, hopefully the squid will cooperate. And uh, while while you were while we're waiting for it to cooperate, I when this came up, I was actually. Uh, uh, working on that other squid, and I've got a possible ID on that. I think it might have been a Echinotuthis atlantica. Yeah, it's a little red, red tissue reaction. Thanks, Mike. E Echinotuthis e atlantica. Go ahead. Yeah, it's a mastigotuthidae. Sure. Yep. I'm coming back down, Ron. Maybe uh, I'm looking... 80 degrees down, you just have a 10 What we're looking at right now is that. You want to probably get the most bizarre right squid I've here. ever seen. <laughs> at least wrong. in that posture. <laughs> I don't know if you'll get them. Oh, we'll get them. 
I wish I could tell you for sure what it was. Maybe. Yep. There we go. That makes All this right. feel a little bit better. We got really quiet here, and the chat room got quiet for a little bit. Uh, everybody okay. seemed to be puzzled for Lasers a while. Are clear. Copy. Okay, we got to go. Yeah, it's a it's a remarkable observation. It's it's not unusual to see uh, squids with their arms folded the back like that. That's a, a typical defensive that. posture. But it's so extreme on so this that it doesn't that even look like a squid meters. anymore. If he stops, if he gets behind. If we were doing yeah. 20 or 30, it wouldn't happen. All right, I'm going to leave you guys with that. I'm swapping out video. Copy that.